most important research I have done was that which I began as an undergraduate student. It was my undergraduate research that opened up the opportunities for learning and for teaching that I have enjoyed ever since. And it was my undergraduate research that generated the questions I have been exploring as a scholar ever since. Today's students are presenting the results of their research that they've been uh, carrying on as part of their courses over the past four or five months. We've got honor students, we've got third year, fourth year, even second year students presenting theses, uh, class research projects, and some in independent study uh, research. Never in my life have I considered going to a game to watch a ref, or have I known anyone that's done that. I was like, you know, maybe that's a good thing to do a story about. They get an opportunity to get up in public, it builds their confidence, which I, as near as I can tell, they've got lots of it already. But it's uh, a standard uh, uh, way of presenting your research in academic conferences. So we can mimic academic conferences. We have moderators, we have questions from the floor, and they take responsibility for their own presentations. It also helps them in terms of just building their confidence in life to get into these kind of uh, situations that otherwise they're, they don't have an opportunity to do this. Or, you know, usually don't. I have no doubt that people are finding this year's fair to be another enjoyable experience. And I think we are always heartened by the ways in which events like today remind us of what the best, what is best about the university as an academic community. It's great to get some feedback from people and I'm glad it sparked some discussion, which is what this is all about. It's all about discussing and exchanging ideas and helping each other learn and grow from the process. So it was really helpful, it was great. Um, it was a really good experience, I thought, and to have criticism and feedback from the people who are watching our presentation and have nays or questions like really ensures that you know a lot about what you're talking about. So. Well, I think uh, presentations like this do concentrate the mind. Uh, they're also a very good preparation for those students who want to go on to graduate school or some kind of postgraduate study. This is the life of an academic um, after the undergraduate experience. So this is a very good primer. It might help people make some decisions about their future. And for those who are committed, this is uh, a way to get used to uh, life after the undergraduate life.